Data is everywhere. We hear it, see it, and even use it. But most of us do not have a clear idea of what data is. So, if you have ever wondered about the invisible world of data that surrounds us every day, this section will clear up all your doubts. Data isn't just random bits and bytes. It's the digital goldmine containing valuable information about everything from people to products. Nowadays, a significant amount of data is generated day by day, and this amount is increasing rapidly. Think about it. According to a survey, every minute, X explodes with 300,000 tweets, about 2.2 million posts on Facebook get likes, and YouTube gets flooded with over 100 hours of video content. Even more than 200,000 emails move across the internet, contributing to this data overflow, even though most of them are spam. Let's zoom into the retail giant Amazon. Every click, every scroll, every purchase, it's all data. This includes both searches and purchases like items viewed, time of viewing, purchased items, contact info such as name, email, phone, address, reviews and ratings, review writing time, prime membership status, and many more. They know what you're browsing, when you're browsing, what you're buying, and even how long it takes you to write that review. This data is then explored to give valuable insight into different parts of the business. For example, Amazon can use the data about the items you viewed to recommend similar products, or they can use what you purchased to recommend it to similar customers. Now, do you wonder about how they do this? Before getting to that point, we need to define a few essential concepts that we will frequently use in the data exploration process to answer these questions. A variable is an attribute that describes a person, place, thing, or idea. The value of the variable can vary from entity to entity. An observation, on the other hand, is a value at a particular period of a particular variable. The process of turning raw data into valuable insights has a few fantastic different steps. Collecting the data. Preparing data before analysis. Visualizing and describing relationships between variables. Identifying and making statements about groups of observations. Extracting interesting rule. Building mathematical models that can be used to understand the data and make predictions. Imagine raw data as rough diamonds straight from the mine. They hold potential, but they're not quite ready for the market. Some raw data examples are pictures of dogs taken by the camera, user comments on a specific product, etc. But before you can make sense of it all, it needs refining. This means that in order to perform analysis, raw data should be processed. Now, processed data is like those sparkling diamonds, carefully cut and polished. Usually, methods like extraction, cleaning, and transformation are performed to convert the raw data into processed data. Some examples of processed data are specific properties of dogs measured from their pictures and keywords extracted from user comments. Processed data are structured, organized, and primed for analysis.